Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. Welcome to another episode of the Empowerment Desk. We greet all our listeners, all our viewers in the mighty name of Jesus. At this moment, I want to introduce my co-host, my brother from another mother, Minister York. Ah, kingdom greetings, wonderful people of God. It's so good to be with you another time. It's so good to, you know, be able to come and share the word of the Lord with yes, you, yes, especially yes. in this time and in this mm -hmm. season. I believe that by the leadership of our host, uh, that there is a word uh, that is going to yeah. lift your spirit for this season and this time. Thank you. Bless the name of Jesus. You know, today I, I want to talk about a, on, on a topic, do not lose hope. Amen. Hope again. Hallelujah. Um, you know, we ha in, in this time that we are living and this this, 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 this pandemic, COVID-19, and, and we have so many um, turbulent times and difficult times and people are, are struggling. Um, people don't know what to do. Marriages have been broken. People losing their business. Uh, a lot, many persons attempted to, to lose hope in God. Mm -hmm. uh, many, many persons are discouraged persons in the body of Christ, you know, yes. um, and that have served God for so long. Um, they are walking away from the faith. Hmm. Um, so we want to encourage you today about do not lose hope. Amen. Amen. You can hope again. Amen. And I want to read the, 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 the scripture verse. It's in Romans chapter 4, verse 18. It said who against all hope, believed in hope, that he might become the father of many nations, according to which was spoken, so shall thy seed be. Mm. Heavenly Father, yes, Lord. we thank you, God. Mm. Father, let your word go forth with power, God. Yes, yes, yes. Let yes, your word yes, touch yes. the heart of the listeners dear Hallelujah. God. Father God, we give you thanks and we give you praise. Let this word, oh God, Hallelujah. ignite hope mm. and faith in the hearts of those that are listening. Let this word, oh God, bring resurrection Hallelujah. power, God, Hallelujah. to those that are on the verge of giving up. Yes. We thank you, God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 The, the Bible says that in Romans 4, 18, against all hope in hope wow. abraham believed god mm. um, abraham was facing a hopeless situation come on come on come on abraham had a promise from god hmm. Ab god promised abraham that you will have a child hmm. and 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 many things in the natural was looking as if this promise would not happen wow so abraham was tempted man of god to be hopeless. Wow. Abraham was tempted to be discouraged because as you can see, naturally, Abraham's body was getting older. Mm. Um, if my memory is correct, I believe he was 99 at that time. Yeah, somewhere like that. And, and everything in the natural mm. is saying that the promise will not come to pass. Wow, wow. Uh, you know, and, 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 and just, and his wife's womb is dead to the point where there, no medical intervention can wow. fix it. Wow. So all those things Abraham is confronted with. Wow. But the Bible says, against all hope, against all hope, even if all those things were happening, Abraham chose to believe God. Wow. Abraham wow. chose wow. 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 to be hopeful. Wow. Ah, I want to talk to somebody this afternoon. Mm. Or maybe, maybe wherever you're listening, it's, it's night time. Mm. That, that you are facing a situation. Wow. And it's looking hopeless. It's looking like, God, you promised me this. You said this would happen. And everything in the natural is saying no. Uh, my sister, the word of the Lord to you, you hope in God. Despite what you see, may you believe 
that God is still able to bring forth his promise. Man of God. Wow, wow, that's so powerful, man of God. And I really love the scripture that you used for today's mm -hmm. teaching, for today's encouragement. Yeah. You know, it speaks, it speaks a lot. Yeah. Um, because when we talk about Abraham, mm -hmm. uh, he is known as yeah. Father Abraham. Yeah. Which means that there's something yeah. significant mm -hmm. about mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, mm -hmm. the mm -hmm. life of Abraham. Yes. Go ahead, man. And, you know, this tells us that even someone as mm -hmm. known and as built yeah. Yeah. as Abraham yes. Go ahead, can get to the point of experiencing hopelessness. Yes. 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 Why am I saying this mm -hmm. is to make the point that mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. hopelessness is a spirit wow. just ahead. like mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. fear is a spirit. Wow. And if you don't address the spirit of hopelessness, yes, yes, yes. it can overtake you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so right off the bat, here is what Psalms 42 verses 5 says. Yeah, go ahead. It says, why are you cast down, all yeah. oh, my soul? And why are you disquieted wow, wow, in wow. me? Hope in God, yeah. for I will yet thank him My God. for the help of yes. his presence. Wow. Go ahead. This tells me, mm -hmm. just like the psalmist, mm -hmm. that there are going to be times and seasons in our lives yeah. when our yeah. inner man, yeah becomes disquieted, yes, yes. becomes hopeless, yeah. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and you got to speak to yourself. Yes, yes. You got yeah. to be able to mm -hmm. say mm -hmm. to yourself, mm -hmm. hope in God. Hope in God. Oh God. Good word. And so already I'm saying to you, we are speaking to you from mm -hmm. across this screen. Yeah. Not because we have not ourselves experienced times of hopelessness, yeah, yeah. but we are able to speak to you and address you because we found the secret yeah. to getting rid of and addressing yeah. hopelessness. Yeah. yeah, you know, you know, man of God, I, I, I can, um, I can um, speak on this topic because I have find myself in a in in, in, in hopeless situations yeah. many times. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I remember man I, I was sick wow. and and battling a, 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 a medical condition mm. that that refused to go away. I'm believing God, I'm quoting the scriptures. Wow. But the, the, my body is just getting weaker mm. and, and, and weaker. And then I, I am lying on this hospital bed and I'm saying, where is Jesus? Wow. Where wow. is my God? And I'm crying and I'm crying. And I'm saying, but God, I'm so faithful to you. I, wow. I, 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 I serve you, God. Why am I in this situation? Hmm. Like you said, the spirit of hopelessness right. is trying to take over to take my life. Mm -hmm. and, 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 um, you know, and there are persons that is in that same predicament oh, now. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That, that, that you have served God and maybe your house is being foreclosed. Hmm. Uh, you, you've been faithful to God and maybe some sickness wants to eat up your, 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 your life. Hmm. It, it's a very tough place to be. But, but I want to encourage you, church. When I was in my valley and when I was in my hopeless situation, one of the things that really encouraged me is the faithfulness of God to wow. what he had promised me. Uh, I knew one thing, church, and one of my favorite scripture verses hmm. is Numbers 23, 19. Wow. 
that says that God is not a man ah. that he should lie. Yes, sir. And I made up my mind, church, that even if I was sick, I was broke, I was busted, hmm. I made up my mind that he who made the promise cannot lie. I don't know who am I preaching to. Uh, come on. Who am I speaking to? Hmm. But, but the person, but, but God that made the promise to you. Yes. He cannot lie. He cannot lie. Uh, if God promised to heal your body, he will heal your body. If, if, if God promised to provide for you, he will provide for you. Hmm. You, you, you. You know, the thing is that, church, people of God, Satan wants to keep you in that place of constant discouragement. Yes. Constant hopelessness. Because he, he, he wants to move your faith. He wants to take you in a place of unbelief. Whenever you are hopeless, you are moving in the territory of unbelief. Yes. Ah, oh my God. How can I say this? Wow, wow, wow. Well, whenever you are, are discouraged, and you start speaking negative things. You start saying, God will not see me through mm. this thing. Mm. You are actually blocking your miracle. Wow. wow. You see, I was discouraged for a time. But when I remember that God cannot lie. Wow. I start quoting the Bible. Come on, wow. somebody. Wow. I start wow. saying, devil is written by his tribes I'm here. Mm. I start saying, no weapon formed against me will prosper. Wow. Because wow. the Bible wow. says, I have wow. put a double-edged sword in your mouth. Wow. My friend, wherever you are, arise. And remember the faithfulness of God. Yes. The faithfulness of God to take you out. Wow. The Bible says that when you go through the valley, come on, somebody. Wow, wow. Ah, wow. Jesus is right there. The Bible says, matter of fact, when you go through the fire, mm. it won't destroy you. Isaiah 42. When you go through the, through, through the flood, yes, it won't overtake you. It will not overtake you. Wow. I had to encourage myself. Mm. I had to speak to myself the word of God. Wow. Or else discouragement would have buried me. Mm. The, the, one of the key things, you put the word of God in your mouth. Bless God. Wow, wow. That's powerful. That's powerful. And you know, one of the things that I want to continue from something that you said was that, you know, you had to, in order to get your hope levels yeah. back up, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. remember the word of God, yeah. 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 recall the word of God, God, but also recite the word yes. of God. Yes. Yes. Remember, recall. Recite, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. reinforce mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. all of these things mm -hmm. you had. I, as you were speaking, these are yeah. the things that I heard yeah. that you had to do mm -hmm. to get your hope back mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. Watch this Romans 8 24 says, wow. For we are saved through hope. Yeah. But hope that is seen is not hope. My God. You see, sometimes, if not most of the times, mm -hmm. we are so uh, fixed yeah. on what we see. Go ahead, prophet. Yeah. Versus or opposed to what we yeah. don't see. Yes. yes. And not only that, but it's amazing that mm -hmm. right now I'm seeing hope as my God. Yeah. I don't see him, but I know it's his day. Yes, yes, yes. The scripture goes on to say, for why does a man still hope mm -hmm. for what he sees? Yeah, my, go ahead. Now, if I see mm -hmm. on this table mm -hmm. a hundred dollar bill then I don't any longer need to hope for yeah. a hundred dollar bill God, because powerful. it's there yes 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 so watch this as you were talking mm -hmm. the Holy Spirit 
was already ministering to me to say, in times of hopelessness, yeah. you have to focus on the unseen. Yeah. Yeah. You have to put your My trust yes. in the unseen mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. in order to experience the seen. My God. What is so different or what is so meaningful in this passage, the one that I read before mm -hmm. from Psalms 42, is that the scripture tells us that, let me go there quickly so that I don't misquote it. The scripture, Psalms 42 verses 5 says, in asking a question, why are you yes. cast down? My God. Oh, my soul. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then in asking the question, two questions as a matter of fact, mm -hmm. it gave the answer. It gave the solution. Mm -hmm. And it says, hope in God. Yeah. Hope in God. Yeah. Yeah. But then watch this as well. Psalms 103. The psalmist David, also a great man of God in Scripture, a man who the Bible describes as a man after God's yeah. heart, the scripture Psalms 103 suggests that he was also experiencing and going yeah. through a time yeah. of hopelessness. Yeah. Yeah. But watch what Psalm, the psalmist David does. He says, bless the Lord, yeah. O oh my yeah. soul, yeah. Yeah. and all that is within me. Mm -hmm. Bless mm -hmm. his holy name. Yeah. Bless the Lord, yes. O oh my soul. And this yeah. is the part that I love. And forget not yeah. all yeah. his benefits. My God. Go ahead. Which means that David had to encourage himself, yeah. going back to what you were saying, man of yeah. God, yeah. about the fact that mm -hmm. God does not lie yeah. and there are some promises, yes. there are some benefits yes. within the fall, yes. within the, the, the regime. Yeah. within the system and the God. kingdom, yeah. the domain mm -hmm. of God. Wow. Wow. But sometimes you got to speak to the inner yeah. man, the inner yeah. soul, yeah. and you got to command it. Yeah. Not only to hope in God, wow. but to bless God, yes. but yes. most yes. importantly, to believe God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so powerful, prophet. Um, and, and you, you talk about the unseen, and that's so powerful. Eh? Because I remember w when I was real sick, man. I'm talking about years of sickness. Wow. And all I could have seen was hopelessness. Mm. All what could I? Um, and sometimes the enemy will play these psychological things in your mind. Mm. You know. But and then I will tell you, hopelessness comes when you get your eyes off the off. promise. Yes. And you focus. And what you see. Yes. Are you with me? Yes. Yes. Ah. Also, all what replays in your mind is the medical condition mm. and my age and I'm losing my youth and I might die. So all what you, you, you see, all what your attention is, is on these things. That is where hopelessness and discouragement creeps in. Yes. But come on, somebody. But if your eyes... It's on the promise wow. of God. Yes, sir. If your eyes is on what Jesus has said. Yes. I remember, I think it was King Joseph in, in 2 Chronicles chapter 20. He said, God, mm. our eyes yes. are on you, Lord. Yes. He, he saw the invading armies mm. coming. Mm, 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 and, mm. and all around him was looking as if he would have been defeated. Oh, yeah. But he made up. His mind yes. intentionally. Yes. Come on, come somebody. on. Come on. That I will keep my eye. Yes. 
yes. on what God yes. has said. Yes, yes. I'm talking to somebody mm. that you attempted to look at what you see now. Yes, yes. Uh, but the word of the Lord to you is you keep your eyes mm. on what have I promised you. What have I said? You know, I, I remember, um, I think it's in John chapter 4. Um, it says that the, the disciples, after the resurrection of Jesus, in the book of John, it said after the resurrection of Jesus, the Bible says that the disciples remembered the word wow. of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You see, sometimes when we are in a crisis, uh, our memory, we forget what God has said. Mm. We, we forget what God said to us on the mountaintop. Wow. And we, we forget the promises in the valley. Wow. Uh, to, to get rid of hopelessness, to er eradicate mm. hopelessness out of your life. Come uh, on you now. Need to remember what God has said about you. Mm, Matter of fact, what you are going through right now, it's not your destiny, it's your preparation. Wow, 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 wow. What wow. you are going through right now is a Romans 8.28 experience where, where the Bible says, all things work together wow. for those that love wow. God. I came to prophesy to someone today wow. Wow. that you have a great calling of God on your life, but mm. as if you look stuck, at least as if you look like this thing ain't gonna mm. happen, as if you have sickness in your body but the word of the Lord to you is that this is your preparation yes, yes. the reason why my faith is so resolute mm. and so strong at times mm. is because of what I went through created that in me wow I want to tell somebody that the pit you are in right now mm. be hopeful it is your preparation yes it is your preparation yes keep your eyes on the promise mm. and I'm not saying something I, I read in a magazine or I read in one of those books it is something that I live wow. when I was facing a, a hopeless medical condition and wow. always being at the hospital you know what I decided I decided to read the promise of God to myself. Mm. I used to read, he who make the promise is faithful. Yes. I used to read, God cannot lie. That if he said by his stripes, we will heal, I am healed. Wow. No matter what my body is saying, mm. I used to call it lying symptoms. Because I believed so much that I was healed, prophet. Mm. That my body was still, you know, I was still feeling sick. You know what I decided to do? I made up my mind, despite what I'm feeling, hmm. the word of God is the word of God. Because you cannot have faith and your feelings. Wow. I, I wow, made up wow, my wow, mind. Wow, wow, wow. Say that again. You cannot God. have faith and Ooh, your feelings. Jesus. I made up my mind to go beyond what I was feeling, beyond what I was seeing, prophet. And I chose to believe God. Let me just read this quick, quick, quickly before, before I, I, I hand over to you. In, in, in Hebrews chapter 10, verse 23, it says, Let us hold fast. The profession of our faith without wavering. Mm. You cannot be double-minded, church. You have to believe God. Because the Bible says a double-minded man cannot receive anything from God. Mm. Uh, church, I had a single mind when I was in trouble. I believe I was healed and that's all what I choose to say. The more I got hospitalized, I keep saying I'm healed. The more I, I had pain in my body, I keep saying that I'm healed. Because wow. I have learned to move beyond my feelings and trust the word of God. I don't, I, I, I don't waver back. Wow. I don't draw back. This is what wow. I believe. Wow. So somebody today, you're experiencing your load of back. Jeez. You're experiencing your discouragement. The word of the Lord to you is you keep your eyes on me. Yes. Uh, don't keep your eyes on, on, on the letter that you have received from the wow. bank. Wow. Threatening wow. to take your house. You mm. keep your eyes on me. Ah, and I say yeah, this, yeah, man yeah, of God, yeah, yeah. you don't keep your eyes on, on all what you're feeling and, and, how, and what the doctors say. And the, you, you keep your eyes that Ooh, Jesus, Jesus Christ, the Holy Ghost. he forgave you of all your sins and healed you of all your disease. Ooh. Psalm chapter 103 verse 3. Ooh. Oh, I feel the Holy Spirit. Huh? Let hope arise. Ah, let hope arise. Wow, 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 wow. This is so powerful. My God, and I love when yeah. you said, man of God, that you can't have the two. Yeah. 
Yeah. You can't have faith and yeah. your feelings. My wow, God, I feel God. like I need to post that as soon as <laughs> I get off of this set. That oh. is powerful. Choose one. Oh, go ahead, you prophet. You cannot Jesus, have that's two. It. It's that? either you are going to have faith yeah. or you're going to let your feelings be in uh, control yeah, yeah, of yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Deep, deep stuff. And I learned years ago that your feelings, mm -hmm. my God, let me help you, hey, it's, it's, it's not something that you should ever put your hope oh, go ahead. or your go trust ahead. in ahead, because your feelings change, man of God. <laughs> my God. Go oh my God, I tell you, today you're uh, feeling like it's this one, yeah, yeah. it's this girl, yeah. and then tomorrow, my brother, <laughs> yeah, if yeah, you yeah, happen yeah, yeah. To yeah, yeah. see somebody yeah, else, yeah, yeah. then your feelings mm -hmm. may switch My upon goodness. you. Go ahead, prophet. But God. your faith. My God, remains your faith. Yeah. Oh my God, Jesus, Jesus, my Jesus, God, Jesus, my God, Jesus, my Jesus, God, Jesus, my God. Jesus, Jesus. Indestructible. My God, your faith mm -hmm, mm -hmm. stands. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It does not waver. It yeah. does not move. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wow. Or at least that's what it should be. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And so I want to reinforce to you mm -hmm. that today mm -hmm. you need to make up your mind that you are not going to be moved by your feelings, yes, but yes, you are yes. going to have a strong faith and you are going to hope again. Wow. I want to continue with this passage wow. because it's important that we use the word of God. And so the psalmist David says, Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. Mm -hmm. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits. Wow. Who forgives all your iniquities? My God. Who heals oh, all your, your, your diseases? diseases. Go ahead, go ahead. Who redeems your life mm -hmm. from the pit? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Who crowns you with loving kindness and tender mercies? Mm -hmm. Watch this. Who satisfies mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. or your mouth mm -hmm. with good things? Wow. Go ahead, prophet. Go ahead. I want to say to you, I know that it's not easy at times. Yeah. 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 I'm not going to sit here mm -hmm. and pretend that all has been well. Yeah. Yeah. And that it, every day of my life yeah. is easy. Yeah. Yeah. And my brother here, my bigger brother, he'll also agree. Yeah. And let me just say, by the way, if you are not willing mm -hmm. to go through, go ahead, prophet. Then maybe, mm -hmm. then you're not ready mm -hmm. for this journey. My God. Because this journey, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. this Christian mm -hmm. pilgrim pathway. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to come with a lot of things. There's going to be a lot of things yeah. being thrown at you yeah. that may at times bring you to a low place. Yeah. 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 And that low place comes with depression, yeah. oppression, mm -hmm. hopelessness, mm -hmm. prayerlessness. Mm -hmm. I mean, and as we go on, we'll talk about some of these things in mm -hmm. other episodes today we are talking about hopelessness mm -hmm. because I want to say to you if I can get you to hope again yeah yep. I can get you to live again yeah. wow, wow. <laughs> and prophet you know oh my god you, you know I want to say this yeah? I, I, I've been serving the Lord for some time and um, every time man of God wow every time that I go through something bad I, I graduate in the spirit oh yeah um, I, I, and every time that I, the enemy think he Ooh, has that's me, that's good. That's good. God, in His awesome greatness, yes, will work it out for my good. You lose a job, watch God give you a better one. Wow! Come on now. As, and you see, when the enemy thinks he has me, prophet, heaven. Mm. Saying, watch, we turn it out hmm. for his good. For his good. So somebody uh, that is hopeless right now, I want, I want to speak to you. Come on, go ahead. Through prophetic declaration. Go ahead, go ahead. I feel Jesus. Go ahead, go ahead. That whatever 
that has brought hopelessness to you mm, come is on what now. God will use hey, you to propel on, you to the next dimension of hey, your life. You're talking, you're talking. Ah, mm. I'm gonna say whatever mm. that have brought discouragement wow, 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 wow. and hopelessness to you hmm. is what God will use to propel you to the next dimension of your life. Wow. Wow, wow. I just remember the name, the man named Joseph. Hmm. In Come that pit, now. hey, God used this thing and propelled hey. him straight to the palace. Hey, 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 Jesus! Just over Abush. two years or three oh years or whatever year, I can't remember. I was sick like a dog, without a hope. Mm. To them, a married man. Look at you. Married now. to a woman hey. of God. <laughs> Look at you now. Oh my whatever. God! Whatever. What a testimony. Whatever. The enemy meant for bad. Ah, come on. God's gonna propel you to a next dimension mm -hmm. of your life. Mm -hmm. Hope in God. Hope in God. Hope and, in God. and just summarizing everything. Keep your eyes. Yes. Come on. That's on it. God. That's it. Keep your eyes on what God has said. Like prophet was saying, you speak to yourself. Yes, sir. You encourage yourself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And ladies and gentlemen, we bless you. Today. Yes, 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 yes. And Father God, we release oh. strength. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes. Somebody right now, God. Yes, somebody that is watching. That have their back against the yes, wall. Yes, Lord. Ah, my Father, in the name of Jesus, God, you make a way, God. Yes. Oh, somebody that needs the school fees to be paid. Yes, Lord. You make a way, Father. In the mighty name of Jesus. Somebody, oh God, that has been waiting on you for a child, God. Jesus, Jesus. An age is coming, God. But in the mighty name of Jesus, there will be a breakthrough, God. Yes. A breakthrough. A breakthrough. Arise, say God. Arise in the mighty name of Jesus. And we thank you, God. Hallelujah. Prophet, in closing, you want to say anything? Ah, uh, you know, I just want to say in closing that, you know, it's not a bad thing. I really want to encourage somebody yeah. who, 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 who may be in yeah. a place of hopelessness. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You are not a bad person if you're in yeah. a space of yeah. hopelessness. Yeah. You're not a, 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 any less of yeah. Yeah. a believer yeah. if you experience times of wow. hopelessness. Wow. Go ahead, go ahead. It just means that you got to speak mm -hmm. to yourself in this season, yeah. in that time. You are meant to draw out of yourself. Because the yeah. thing is, it, it's there in you already. Yeah. That's why David could have been able to say, yeah. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. It was in him. My God. It's just that it was not happening at the moment mm -hmm. because of what he was facing. Yeah. Now, as I get to that point of the word facing, mm -hmm. I want to reiterate, I want to strengthen the point that Minister Matthew made when he says, don't look at the things that are around you. Yeah. And it's quite easy to do that. Yeah. Easy. But I want to really encourage you and challenge you uh, Jesus, Jesus. to keep your eyes on the promise. Keep your eyes on the promise yeah. maker. Yes, my God, my God. Keep your oh, eyes Jesus. on the promise maker. You encourage me, prophet. You encourage me. During the last couple of weeks, yeah. I've been encouraging myself. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I've been saying, God, I don't have all that I want. Yeah. But I sure have all that I need. Yeah. My God, and yeah. I'm going to work with it. Yeah. I'm going to work it. Yeah. And that's what we have to do in this time, mm -hmm. in this season, in this time of COVID-19, when it seems like so many things are happening. Yeah. Even for those of us who are Caribbean people who are now in what's called the hurricane season. Yes, 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 yes. 
You got to begin to speak to yourself. You got to begin to prophesy for yourself. All Uh, respect and honor to prophets. But I want to say, don't wait for the prophet to prophesy to you. You better open up your mouth and And prophesy to yourself. And so over the last couple of weeks, I've been saying, I don't have all that I want, but God, I have all that I need and I'm going to work it. You got to work the word of God. God. That's the only way it's going to work for you. And so lastly, I can't come away from this point. If I didn't learn anything tonight, and I hope it's the same with you, you can't have two. (laughs) You cannot have the two. You're either going to move and operate off of your feelings or you're going to operate off of your faith. May your faith be lifted right now. I prophesy right now under the authority of God. Seven levels of your faith. For the Bible says that everyone is given Yes. A measure of faith. Yes, yes, prophet. Go ahead. But I prophesy that in your faith Jesus. measure ah, is measuring up. Hallelujah. Yes, I prophesy that your faith measure is measuring up. Yeah. And that you will begin to yeah. operate yes. not only on or off of that yeah. measure of faith, but from the place of the wow. gift of faith. Wow. 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 And even so much more from that place. Yeah of faithfulness may this fruit be yours today the The fruit of faithfulness in jesus name amen hallelujah Hallelujah. we greet everyone we just pray god's blessing and god's strength over your life amen Um, we just want to encourage all our listeners to subscribe amen subscribe um, spread the message amen Um, we have our youtube channel the empowerment desk and then just you know you can receive your message your encouragement so we thank you guys for listening and may god bless you and may god keep you in jesus name Amen. amen